House fires during the holidays cause up to $25 million in property damage. TV6's Houghton Hancock viewer reporter Sarah Blakely talks with the Houghton Fire Department about how to prevent a fire in your home this holiday. Fire truck sirens aren't exactly the kind of jingle bells anyone wants to hear. But the reality is holiday decorations are responsible for nearly 400 house fires in the U.S. each year. Houghton firefighter Buck Foltz says the number one cause of holiday fires is candles. A lot of us have the, the desire to have nice candles and the smells at the Christmas time. You never put lit candles on trees or anything else. And I guess this is a time of year when we really need to think about the little ones. We need to really watch how we, where we put those candles, they have to be high. Never leave one lit at night or when you're not in, the, in that room. And for those who have a real tree for Christmas, it's important to make sure it's watered every day. This video from FEMA shows just how quickly a dry tree can catch fire. Foltz says there are other ways to prevent fires in your home as well. Don't burn wrapping paper in a fireplace. Keep your tree away from any heat source. Don't overload electrical outlets. And if it seems questionable, don't do it. One of the most important things that everybody can have in their home is a fire extinguisher. Now, if you've never shot a fire extinguisher before, it's very simple. It's as easy as one, two, and three. And where there is fire, there is sure to be a burn. A first aid kit and burn cream should be handy in your home for minor burns. Well, you can use the cool cloth to help with discomfort, but you don't want to put ice on, on any burn. Um, that skin is compromised, and so, you know, you could, because the, there's decreased sensation, you could um, cause more injury by, by putting something like ice on that burn. Sarah Blakely, TV6 News, Houghton.